Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. This is Kristen with another Chance Resale. I want to start off with this video with this um, necklace. I don't know if you guys remembered. I got this from, where did I get this? The Estate Clear Out. And it's a Trifari, Crown Trifari. Um, it looked very unique to me. It had these like jelly, they're not actual jelly, but they look like jelly molds. They are glass. And it seemed a little special to me. So when I was filming, I'm pretty sure I looked it up and I, no, maybe I didn't do it on camera. Anyway, I looked it up um, because I didn't want to sell it on camera. I thought it was something special. So I ended up finding a brooch that was very similar to this that sold for over $100. So I decided to put this on bid on eBay and let me show you the results. Boom, look at that, woo! So I was right, it was something special. It got 14 bids and I ended up selling it for a total of $152.50. It shipped out the other day. I did get extra insurance on it because the way the <laughs> the way that the shipping is going lately, I needed it. Anyway, I just want to show you this so you can um, be a little bit more cautious when you find pieces that may seem a little bit different or special to do some research on it. And I know um, there are people that have channels or that want to start channels, but they're nervous to put the pricing in their videos like I do. Don't be nervous. If you aren't sure, don't give a price. Say you have to do research on it. Say you have to um, write it on the screen. And then after the video's over, you can research it and edit and put some information on the screen. I do that all the time. So, you know, have faith in yourself and check things out if you think you need to. People make mistakes all the time. I've made tons of pricing mistakes, but you know what? Every day is a learning experience, and as long as I'm making a profit, and if I undersold something, hey, guess what? That person got a really good deal, they're really happy about it, and even though I made a profit, I'm still okay with that. So, that, with that being said, just, you know, be a little bit cautious when looking at jewelry. You never know what you can find. And this even had a lot of wear on it. it I noted it all on the listing. There was wear, you know, basically everywhere. <laughs> but it still sold and it got fought over for $152.50. Boom. So I wanted to share that with you guys. Also, I wanted to say that the winner of the brooch, um, she did comment on the video, but she did not email me her mailing address. So um, if you're watching, please email me. It's Wednesday. Today is the last day for you to get your email, I mean, your mailing address into me, or I have to you know, do the drawing again and give it to somebody else. Um, so please email me with your mailing address. And today's video is going to be another jewelry haul. So let's get into it. You guys know to email me at another chance resale one at gmail.com. Please check that sold list pinned in the comments section. You guys, that's really important, all right? Um, you guys may not think it's important or you may not care, but I put a lot of time into doing that sold list to help out everybody, so just check it out. Check it out in the comment section before you email me and um, you know, see if your item there is, is sold or not, and I really appreciate it. Um, I accept PayPal, shipping is $5 under a pound, and international and over a pound goes by weight in your location. Um, please give me timestamps or screenshots in your email. Everyone that does that, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. I just, I love to be able to just 
bang out invoices and not have to go back and forth in emails and taking up everybody's time. So thank you all for being so um, helpful and what else is the word I'm looking for? I don't know, but thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, what is this? I don't know what this is. <laughs> it's got this little buckle type thing, but it is all kinds of scratched up. It's probably a necklace. I don't think it's a belt. It is awfully teeny tiny, but it could be. So I don't see any maker marks. It might be a belt because it is a little bit stretchy, but it's really tiny. So you know what? We're just going to put this into crafting because I'm not really sure what to do with it. So that's going to be a dollar. All my craft items are a dollar. Let's see what this piece is. This is wood with some gold tone beads in between. Uh, I do not see a clasp. It's in excellent condition. This is still the, um, it's like a collaboration of all kinds of locations where this jewelry came from, um, you know, all different kinds of lots from my friend. This is a 22, 22 inch wearable length. We will do $6. I'm getting my nails done today, so this boo-boo will be no longer. <laughs> okay. And I think I'm going to go into fall colors now since it is now officially fall. Even though they're kind of dreary colors and I don't like it. But hey, we're going to go with it. Um, okay, this seems like a, a wrap bracelet. Okay, go the right way there. So we're going to just pretend for a second. I don't know, whatever. I like the stone, it looks like a soda light. It is cold to the touch, so it's probably genuine. Um, I don't see any maker marks, but it's pretty cool. Uh, let's do, let's just do five on it. Five dollars. Here, I see a pair of earrings. Trying to get it out, there we go. These are glass, really pretty. We'll do $4. This is pretty. Don't see any maker marks, but it's a double strand gold tone with these really pretty like purplish beads. Am I focused? Focus. Um, let's get a length. Wearable length is 11 and a half inches. Let's do six on that one. That's in really good shape. I, he I uh, see some stones, so um, let me put on Pressy and see if that's amethyst. So let's turn that on and while she's warming up, we'll keep going. This is pretty blue faceted stones. No maker mark. It is a bypass, so you can adjust it. It does have a little bend in it right there. So we'll do $5. All right, here's, here's Pessy. So we're going to assume these are amethyst, and let's see. Yep. Cool. So we have an amethyst stretchy. We'll do $5 on that. This looks like it's 19, that brand 1928. <laughs> but there's no markings, and there's no design on the back is very pretty nonetheless. 
It does have an extender. It's on the shortest length right now, which is 12 inches wearable to the dragonfly. Let's do seven on this one. This one's nice. Okay, that's broken. So we're gonna put this into craft. We have a torque necklace, but it is pretty, it has some pretty significant wear and chipping of the silver tone. So I'm gonna put this into craft. I don't really feel comfortable selling that as wearable. Plastic blue and gold tone beaded necklace. Pretty nice, pretty nice. It's about an eight and a half inch wearable length. We'll do four on that one. Okay, this is very dirty. Um, I'm just gonna put it into craft. This is vintage, a very nice gold tone chain. Look at that. It's really nice. This is definitely like a collar length. Yeah, it's an eight and a half inch wearable length. Really nice condition. Let's do six bucks on that one. What is this? So this is another torque necklace, but it has Oh, excuse me, all these danglies. I think they're glass. This is cool. So it's a gold tone torque, and then it's got this faux suede with all these glass beads. It's pretty. Very um, bohemian. So let's do, um, there is some wear to the extender. So let's just do $6. <clears throat> That's cool. That's very different. That would be a very cool um, piece for your Halloween costume. It can be like a festival girl or something. Okay. Oh, look. Here's one of those um, uh, safety pin jewelry things. Oh, the blue beads have all this peeling on it. I was trying to see if that's how the beads are, but no, they're peeled. Damn, that sucks. That stinks. Um, yeah, because they're, they're supposed to be solid blue. So let's just get, there is a clasp, but let's just get a wearable length. It's 16 inches to the pendant. Um, we'll just do like three bucks on it if someone wants to use some of these beads, but that's pretty cool. That's a bummer that they're all um, like scratched up. This is a really long silver tone necklace, no maker. It has this cool pendant, kind of a tribally sort of aztec -y with the tassels. It does have an extender, which I don't really know why. It's pretty darn long on its own. But the shortest length is 18 inches wearable to the pendant. We'll do five bucks. This is pretty. This looks like something Chloe and Isabel would make. I like this. It's all plastic though. So I'm sure it's probably just a faux abalone, but look how pretty that is. Gold tone, it's in really good condition. With an extender, it do, and it is on the shortest length, which is an eight inch wearable. That's nice, I like it. Let's do seven on that one. We have a vintage piece with a really cool clasp. 
I don't see any markings. These are plastic, but actually they're pretty cool. If you look at, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see it. Oh, kind of. They kind of have like a, like a liquidy look to them. Like they're not solid. So that's pretty cool. Let's get this knot out. They are super long. Wearable length of 26 inches, so it can be doubled and probably even tripled if you use the clasp. We'll do five bucks. Oh, look. Is that gold nuggets? Wonder if that's real gold. What is fool's gold? <laughs> I don't know. Um... Got a little bit of verdigris on the chain. Yeah, there's verdigris all over the chain. It's in it's in between. It's in there. So I don't really know what to do about this. Could try to clean it. Or I can try to take this off. You know what? Let's try that. Let's take the pendant off. There we go. We're going to put this into crafting if anybody wants that. Um, and then this I will put on a different chain. So if anyone's interested in that, um, I don't know, I have to find a chain. So I guess you can just email me. It won't be too much. All right. No maker. But this is cool. It's got these like modern leaf type motif. Oh, it is marked. S-A-C. I don't know who that is, but this is very nice and it's in very good condition. Maybe I should look it up. It's an eight inch wearable. Let's see if anything even comes up because that's kind of a weird abbreviation. SAC necklace, let's just put. Oh yeah. So like 15 bucks. Oh, it's a Sarah Coventry? Oh, look at that. Did you guys know that? Let me know in the comments if you knew that. Here's the same one right here for $12.95. Wow, so look at that. I learned something new today. SAC is Sarah Coventry. Awesome. Okay, cool. So um, let's do $10 on this piece. That was nice. Very nice. There's wear on the fold over clasp here. I see a maker mark, I guess, of star. There is wear in between each of the little links, but it's really not too bad. It's just the clasp that has the most. And it is a seven and a half inch length. We'll just do four on that one. This looks like a lanyard type of thing because it has the little hook here. So you have some stars and the hook to put your badge or your keys. It has a magnetic closure. 15 inch wearable length. We'll do five. Let's dump out the rest of this bag. I seem to do really well with the box hard case boxes like this. So let's open up this. It looks like all the stones are there. Oh, cool. Oh, it's Avon. So it's an Avon makeup compact, but it's empty. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's do 10 on it. It's in good condition. Let's look at this ring. Ooh, look at that. That's kind of Damascene style, right? little fishy. I like it. 
None of the none of these rings ever fit on the finger I want. I like, you know, like middle finger rings. Bummer. I don't see any markings. Not precious metal. Let's get a size. Six and a half. I'm sure you can um, pull this a little bit because it's a bypass ring to make it a little bit bigger. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go too much, but um, let's do ten on it. I like him. This is neat. So we have a silver tone. It's like a little tree branch. I don't see any maker marks. There's no clasp. I like the chain. It's that chunky link. It's a 12 inch wearable length. Let's do $5. Ann Taylor. It's got a little bit of wear there. But this is definitely a wrap bracelet. Um, let's do five. Hong Kong. All right. I think that dates it around the 80s. Green. Lucite, maybe. Rose necklace. Very long. It can be doubled, probably tripled with the clasp. 26 inch wearable length. Let's do $6. Oh, what's that? That looks pretty. Ooh, I like this. This reminds me of Juicy Couture. It is not marked. It is a necklace with a front front toggle. You can wear it to the back, but why would you? I want I would want this to show. It's definitely um, would be a collar. Tight collar necklace. I'll give you a total length. Yeah, 16 and a half inches. So that's like the perfect collar necklace. Let's do um, let's do 10 on this one. This one's really cool. And all of the stones are present and accounted for. Really nice. We have a D brooch. Four dollars. Here's a very uh, vintage necklace. I don't really know why there's loops on the end though. That's kind of weird. Not sure, but these are plastic. We'll do four dollars. Gold tone necklace. See, this does kind of look like it would be gold, gold, gold. Not. Let's get a measurement. 19 inches wearable, $5. I don't know what's in there. Mm, it looks like some type of seed. <laughs> Not really sure. It's plastic. Just a probably collar necklace. We'll do four bucks. Here's some rings. Ooh, look at this one. I don't see any markings. It's a nice costume. Oh, there's missing a pearl. Ugh. And there's scratching on the pearl on the other pearls. It is adjustable. So unfortunately, it's gonna have to go into crafting. That's really pretty though. Let's see this one. 
This one's adjustable as well. These are plastic. Yep. So we'll just do three bucks on that. All right, what's this whole bag of? These look like all earrings. Oh boy. All right. So let's let me take out a bunch and I'll come back and we'll hey, let's start with these. So this is really cool. This is a set right here for the gambler. <laughs> these are earrings. They have the dice in there. They're clip-on earrings. And then you have the um, necklace to match. Really, really cool. So we're going to do um, $8 on this set. Then we have these are... Oh, we're going to do a deal. So... All the earrings are going to be my usual deal. Buy three, get one free. Every third one, you'll get one free. Um, and these are all going to be $4 unless otherwise mentioned. Look at these. Some Cleopatra clip-ons. They are marked Hong Kong. These are really cool, even if they're just for your jewelry collection. These are not marked, these are clip-ons. So all these, remember, are $4, not marked. Buy three, get one free. These are shoe clips. These are marked Japan. They're like a champagne faux pearl. These are also marked Japan, and they have like the really cool plasticky flowers these are actually dkny oops dkny right there and underneath okay four dollars buy three get one free these are faux pearl clip-ons these are the screw backs These are the matching earrings to the Sarah Coventry um, necklace I showed earlier. And see, look, these are actually marked Sarah Cove. So these, $4. Get them while they're hot. Not marked. Really pretty. All right, and let me cut out and I'll okay, bring back, back. So here's some more. These are all going to be um, $4 as well, except these. These are bone um, flowers, and the backs are marked. Let me just get my loop so I make sure I'm saying the right thing. It, they're 1 20th 12K gold filled, these ones, the clip-ons. So these ones will be um, $6 and will not be the free item. You would have to buy three, including this one, and then you'd get a $4 one for free. So these are not marked. These are very cool. These are not marked. They're kind of like a door knocker clip-on. These ones are really cool. They're a clip-on. They're not marked, but they dangle. Really awesome. These pretty ones. Clip-on. Oh, they are marked. These are Avon. Okay. I did not see that at first. Okay, here's uh, more clip-ons. These are gold tone, really pretty. Remember, these are all $4. Buy three, get one free. Not marked, these are really pretty. These look like those like ninja throwing stars things. <laughs> okay, clip-ons, not marked. Clip-ons, not marked. Purple stones, clip-ons, not marked. So make sure you give me a screenshot of these ones, guys. It'll be easier. Or timestamp, you know, definitely timestamp and or screenshot works the best. Okay, so be right back. back again. So again, $4 each. Buy three, get one free. Make sure you give me timestamps or screenshots. Um, timestamps, honestly, they actually work the best, so I don't have to dig back through the video, um, looking for the screenshots. Okay, anyway, so these clip-ons are really cool. I like those. 
We have a lot of um, clip-ons that are really great for the holidays, like these. Really pretty. They are not marked. We have these stars, dangle stars with the little Aurora Borealis. We have these little cuties. These are not marked clip-ons. These are clip-ons, not marked. Nice little button ones. These ones I thought were missing the center, but since they both don't have a center, I'm just going to assume that's how they were made. These are Sarah Coventry. I don't think they were ever worn. The ear pad is really nice. Unmarked. These are glass. These are Sarah Coventry clip-ons. These are pretty cool. These are unmarked. Hold on, let me get it the right way. There we go. Cute little dangles. These ones are unmarked as well. It's like a wood cabochon. It's pretty cool. Unmarked. Nice classic red and gold. Here we have some really cute Christmas trees. Unmarked clip-ons. And then these are Avon clip-ons with the really cool Aurora Borealis faceted. Okay, let's keep going. La la la. So we have this last bag. All right. Let's see what we got. These are cool, all right. They remind me of unicorns. Very pretty colors. Let's bring you guys back down. So those will be included in the sale, the buy four, get one, uh, buy three, get one free. Wow, look at this. Wowie. Oh, and I wanted to welcome any new subscribers. Welcome. I noticed I was getting a few new customers in my emails. Thank you guys so much for joining the family. And if you're not subscribed, you can do so right down here. It's free. And make sure you click the bell to all so you're notified every time I make a new video. This is really nice. I really like this paw print. It's definitely got some weight to it. We will do $5. These are really nice. I don't know what they're made out of. Like a metal? I'm not sure. But... Three, uh, four dollars in the sale. This is an earring, so I don't see the mate right now, so we'll hold on to that. Ooh, I like this. All the stones are here. No maker. That's a bummer. That's really nice. So wearable length, there is an extender. It's on the longest, actually. So that's a nine inch wearable to the pendant and it can go shorter. Let's do six on that one. That one's pretty. What in God's green earth is this? It's a chicken. <laughs> what the? Here, I see the other one right here. How silly. All right, they're in the deal. They're in the sale. This is very worn. This is gonna go into craft. Here's an earring. I don't see the mate yet, so we'll hold off. This is nice. This is one of those um, pull bracelets. You put it on and then you pull to make it tighter. I love the metal tassels, very cool. This is in very good condition. Let's do five on it. Okay, just a silver tone and black necklace. It's on the longest length extension, which is a nine inch wearable, can go shorter, $5.
Here's a little um, umbrella brooch. We'll just do three bucks. Here's an earring. We'll hold off on that. I don't see the mate yet. Here is a silver tone chain. No markings. It's in good condition. Nine inch wearable. Eh, Four dollars. Here's a stretch with some uh, winter glass beads. Four dollars. This is glass. Oh, it says 925 on the clasp. 11 and a half inch wearable length, $10. Here's another earring we'll hold off to the side. Let's dig for some more. Oh, I oh, there's a whole bag of brooches. All right, let's put that to the side for now. Uh, okay, here's we could just get this straight. There's an earring we'll put to the side. We have a pendant, four dollars. This is just gonna go into craft. It's like a metal mesh bangle. Okay. Faux pearl necklace with that little pendant. 14 inch wearable length. It's all right, it's in all right condition. We'll just do $5. I don't know how this got in here when this earring is closed, that's kind of weird. So we'll hold off on that earring for the mate. All right, this is gonna go into craft. There's some wear around the pendant here. Those beads can definitely be repurposed. Here's the other earring. Okay, really cool. They're included in the deal, $4. Buy three, get one free. Make sure you guys are checking that sold list in the comments. It really helps with the amount of emails I receive and my sanity and getting back to you guys in a timely manner so I don't have to keep saying if things are available or not. So please take a look at that list. I take a lot of time to update it with every sale. So please help me by helping you guys. What um, What's going on here? All right, we're just gonna put this into crafting. <laughs> Not gonna sit there and untangle that. Ooh, this is pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. It does say 925 China, but this does not look like it's sterling. No, it's magnetic. So you're a faker. However, it is still pretty. Where's the, here's the clasp. Actually, I have my mandrel. I don't even have to undo it. It's a seven inch bracelet. And we will do $6. Oh wait, we're missing a flower, right? Yep, poop. Craft, that stinks. This says Crown Trifari, ooh. $5. <laughs> Here's an earring. This is pretty. We'll hold it to the side. Mm. This has got a lot of wear. This is going to go into craft. Oh, 
oh, here's this other earring. What are you? Oh, you're Bugs Bunny. It says pewter on the back. So they'll be included in the deal. Um, this is gonna go into craft. I don't like the way that looks. The, it's very worn. Okay, what is this? Okay, I don't know, $4. This looks pretty cool. Oh, there's two here. So here, craft. <laughs> this is pretty cool. It's very uh, asymmetric. I thought I saw a maker, but I guess not. It's pretty cool with the red, the red cabochons. It's on the tightest, shortest length, and it's eight inches to here. So let's do um, six bucks on that. Here's a brooch. You know what, let me um, put this to the side and we'll go over all the brooches together. And we'll do a deal on those. This is gonna go into crafting. Ooh, look at this. I love it. Really nice, look at the um, elephant down there. This is cool. There is some wear to the um, clasp, but this is really nice. We're gonna do 10 bucks on that. Here's this other earring. So that's included in the deal, $4. Buy three, get one free. Wow, look at this. Talk about a bib. Statement necklace. It's very heavy. It's gold tone. It's like that light gold tone though. Definitely a collar necklace. Really great idea for a Halloween costume. We'll do $5. You have to put that somewhere separate. It's so big. i put it on that side. All right, let's finish up this bag and then we'll go through the brooches. All right, here's this other earring. Oh no, but the stone is coming out. I don't know. We're just gonna put these into craft, that stinks. I don't know if I can get that back in. Can you see? Oh, man. All right, we're going to put all the brooches to the side and go over them all at once. Here's this other earring. Four dollars. I don't know. I guess that's a Fitbit. I have no idea if it works. I don't know anything about it. So, uh, four dollars. Let's see, looks like everything's here. So we'll just do like three bucks on that. Does this come off? Yes, that comes off. Really pretty purple like cat eye stone, $4. Okay, we have a set here. Really nice, it's plastic. Um, it does have an extender, it's like a matte gold tone. We'll do um, $8 for the set. The brooch we'll put to the side. 
Oh, here's that piece. Well, if anyone wants to fix it, there you go. There's a brooch. Here's a necklace. Yanni Z. All right. Oh, we're missing stones. Craft. Here's a ring. It's a little worn to the back. It's a seven and three fourths. We'll do four dollars. Ooh, these earrings look cool. It's a little bent, but there we go. I just fixed it. So that's like a black. Is it black? Yeah, black cabochon. Long dangles. Love these. They're included in the deal. Four bucks. There's a brooch I'll put to the side. Here's the other earring. Very pretty. Deal. It's in the deal. Here's a ring. No maker. Size six, five dollars. There's another brooch. Plastic green necklace. Tis vintage. 14 inch wearable length. Five dollars. Oh wow, that's pretty. No markings. It has like a heart chain. How cool is that? All right, come on. Very pretty. It's on the shortest length. It can go longer, but right now it's sitting at an eight inch wearable. We'll do eight on that one. Craft. Oh look, here's one of the, I love these ones. These um, Asian bracelets, really cool. I don't see any maker marks. All right, it's probably nephrite. Yeah. So these are nephrite. Where's the clasp? Here it is. Oh, is the clasp broken? It is. The, the piece that you push down on is broken and stuck inside of here. So it doesn't pull. All right. Um, I'll just sell this for $4 for the components. Let me just see something. Yeah, $4 for the components. Craft. What is going on? How did this get on here? Here we go. Ew, I don't know what all this hair is. Ew. Now how did that get in there? Can you guys see that? How did that do that? It's in the loop. All right. All right, well, if you want either of these pieces, you're getting both. So you're either gonna get <laughs> the sweater clips or the, the charm bracelet. And it's $4 for both, how about that? <laughs> And there's a charm that probably came off of that, so I'll put that with it. It's a brooch. Here's a long necklace. It's got gold and silver tone. It is a 28 inch wearable length. It is in nice condition. $5. All 
All right, I don't know what all this stuff is. Oh, here's a pair of earrings. Ooh, little unicorns, very cute. They'll be included in the deal. They look brand new. Here's a stick pin, $4. Here's just a gold, this is just a bag of earring backs. I'll hold to the side. A gold tone, where's my measure? Chain necklace, 11 and a half inch wearable, $4. All right, let's bang out all these brooches. I'll lay them out and right, I'll be right let's back. Start. So these ones over here are marked. So this one is an art, which I told you guys is Arthur Pepper. Um, we're gonna do 10 on this one. These are like, I don't know, some type of plastic. $10 on this one. Make a new pile over here. This one is Avon. This will be six. And this one is Jerry's. This will be five. So now um, all the brooches will do th buy three, get one free as well. Um, just the higher marked, higher item, higher priced items will not be your free item. So all of these are $5. Oh wait, not this one. This is a mini mosaic. It's marked Italy to the back. This one's gonna be 15. Okay. So all these are not marked. And if you guys just wanna give me a screenshot with which one or ones you would like. I'll flip them all over. Um, they are all modern. This one has um, a little bit of a different clasp but all the rest are rollovers. Five bucks. All right, okay, let's I do lied. I'm gonna do one more set after this. <laughs> so here are the marked ones. This is a Coro right there. This one will be seven. This is a Sarah Coventry. There's a little bit of light scratching to the faux pearl, but that'll be five. This one is Avon. Five. And these ones are not marked, so they're all five dollars. They are all modern. This one's probably the most vintage. That one's cool because it like it's it like stands up. And you have a little um Tiger's eye turtle tie clasp. Five dollars. Buy three, get one free. Um, all right, let's do the last the last set. Pair stick pin. Ooh, that one's pretty. Mother of Pearl looks like a moth. <laughs> so far, none of these are marked. All $5. Buy three, get one free. What is that guy? Like a little bumblebee dude. This one says Sarah Coventry. Canada. Another little knife for that fork. <laughs> Looking them over before I give them. Ow, I just poked myself. There's a horsey on that one. Butterfly. And an apple. This one's Avon. It looks just like this, but this one's not marked. Hmm. Okay, so these are the last. 
So I hope everyone enjoyed. Make sure you're giving me timestamp, screenshot, PayPal, email, and mailing address if you have not bought from me before. Thank you all for watching and thank you for being my subscribers and showing your support. I love each and every one of you. Make sure you check that sold list and click the thumbs up and we will see you in the next one.